This is something like out of the movie Fight Club. Organized fights between local teens. Time set up, the brawls even taped, and video like this one burning up the internet. Right now, Action News reporter Julie Bonovitz joins us live in Ypsilanti with details. Julie? Stephen, a lot of concern in this neighborhood, especially growing after those videos have been posted on YouTube and people, including officials, can see the horrible things that are being done in them. The fights are mostly teenage girls delivering blows to other teenage girls. Knock down, drag out fights that are organized, wagered upon, and then posted on YouTube. We're trying to identify the kids, get them to the same table with the parents, and try, try to get to the bottom of it. Angela Babish, president of the New West Willow Neighborhood Association, helped break up a fight of about 50 people Monday night. As soon as we started walking up, they dispersed. I mean, like that. The videos like this one started popping up on YouTube a little over a week ago. The playground at West Willow Park in Ypsilanti Township is routinely used as the boxing ring. There's also some references to making money or people winning or losing on the fights. And that's what's leading to the idea that this is a fight club. And the spectators, they're not just other teens. They're infants and strollers and, you know, three, four, five-year-old toddlers. There's also some adults in the videos that are spectators. A group of boys and girls at the park tell us the fights are organized on social media sites. Yeah, they organize, betting, everything. 16-year-old Janique Patterson says people from different high schools participate. That's how people saw their problems when they beefing and stuff. And those living in West Willow say the fighting is nothing new. When I was growing up, everybody wasn't putting it on YouTube, so maybe that's why it was so hidden and behind closed doors that nobody knew. Officials are trying to stop the fight club before one of these teens winds up in the hospital or worse. Some of these teens from the videos have already been identified, but officials say call police if you see any of the fights happening. Even if you can get a good look at what the two people that are fighting are wearing, that will help them crack down on the problem. We're live in Ypsilanti Township, Julie Bonovich, Channel 7, Action News.